Yes, I think so. Um, in terms of special status for the border, for sure. Um, but they, it would have to be very carefully negotiated because, you know, let's make no bones about it, there are additional issues between Spain and the UK over Gibraltar and uh, the, the, the scale of it. I mean, Northern Ireland has got, you know, the Irish government who are remaining in the EU batting on uh, very, very strongly on the border issue. Gibraltar does not have Spain doing that, so I, it's, it's different, it's different. But I hope that, and I do my best to keep reminding people that, you know, don't forget Gibraltar, it, it, that problem still needs to be dealt with. I know a lot of Brits who don't know a great deal about Gibraltar and, and, how, and, and the recent history. I mean, we know because we know over the last 10 years the, the, all of the things that have happened in the waters, all of the border closures, the inconveniences. Most Brits don't know about that and they think of Gibraltar as a really a great place that's very enthusiastic about being British. I think when it, that, that issue is really focused on in the British press, beyond the sort of just sabre rattling and saying, you know, hands off our Gibraltar, which is great, but you know, how are we going to deal with this situation if, if we're Brexiting? When that does come on the table, as Northern Ireland now has in sharp focus, I think a lot of British people are going to say, no, you know, we can't, we can't let them down. They have to be supported. And I'm not entirely sure what the government's doing to um, create that support.